This is my cat, April. I don't know exactly what breed she is, but I looked it up and it seems like she is a bi-colored cat, I think it's called, where she's all white and some black spots. April has been out in and out of shelters and she was taken from and by a foster home after she ended up getting pregnant at four months old and she stayed with them until she was six months or probably seven months and that's when me and my parents got her we got her around my birthday which was in april and clearly i wasn't really clever because i named her after the month April is a wonderful cat and I'm glad that we have her in our lives. She is a very funny and clever cat, but sadly because of her past she gets scared really easily and she jumps at any noise that is made sometimes. Her best friend is Hope. She is about around six months right now. We got her a few months ago, like <laughs> in October. We love her a lot. She has these cute little cross eyes where she ends up running into walls because of them. Ever since we got her, she loves sticking around April a lot and that's very good for April because she doesn't get that much attention. So having a little playmate is really good for her. Sometimes little Hope here decides to go and jump at her and have some fun with her. A funny thing about April is how no matter how many times I try to have her use a scratching post, she doesn't do it. She decides to scratch my chair instead. See, look at her go, just scratching away. And she taught little Hope how to scratch at the chairs too, so I have to deal with her also. This is damage to one of my chairs. The other one is a lot worse than this. I tried so hard to make her go into the I even put cat and then find a scratching post to have her try and use it, but no, it's not good enough. The chair's much better to use. There are times when I am sleeping and she decides, to, it depends how I'm laying, but um, when I'm sleeping, if I'm laying on my back while I'm sleeping and in the morning she wants to wake me up, she goes and walks on me, lays on my stomach, licks my nose for a bit or my cheek or whatever on my face. And then after a little bit of licking, she bites me hard and I wake up. Who needs an alarm clock when she wakes me up at 7 a.m. every morning? <sighs> the other way she wakes me up is depending if I'm laying on my side or not. So if I'm laying on my side, she comes up to me and she like sits down, stares at me for a bit and then she decides to just scratch my back. I don't even need to be asleep for these. She just randomly does them sometimes too, even when I'm awake. I think it's her just wanting attention from me. Anyways, that is April and I guess Hope also. And I love them a lot and when I move out, I'm taking them with me to have more crazy adventures. Yeah.